continued his comeback after seven months' absence with his third start in nine days. Barry Davis had attention filled St James's Park. Now there's room to give it to Gillespie, and Fox got himself into a horrible position. Here's Lee. Watson. Caught out again, Roy Fox. Time for Gillespie. Oh, and off. Ginola. Header was by Beardsley. It's a disappointing uh, cross, really. It didn't pick out anybody in particular. Beardsley coming on with the header and finally off the thigh of uh, David Ginola. Fell kindly. There's one back by Beardsley. Ginola. Ferdinand. Lee. Batty! Good save by Walker. Really struck. Tried to chip it over. And chipped it wide. Ferdinand. Best we've seen from him for some little time. Ginola underneath it. Slipped by Edinburgh. Good positioning by Batty. And the cross must be surely no! Two players went for the same ball. And somehow Ferdinand contrived to knock it wide past not only the post but past Gillespie as well. And in fact, Gillespie got there ahead of him. Sheringham, Anderson makes the run. Blocked by Elliott. Albert now back in defence. Fox. Dazelle. He's done well. And he scored. Really good turn by Jason Dazelle. of Kevin Keegan then was almost one of resignation to the one incident no more than that but it was very well done by Jason Dazelle well taken third goal of the season Spurs lead Ginola good try got a bit of the crossbar as well I think in fact only the crossbar Ginola thought that it had been touched by the goalkeeper, which was my impression too. But a corner hasn't been given. Snapshot. Now, I think the referee was right. Ginola. Espria. Three waiting. And it's in. Les Ferdinand. It's been a long time in coming. Ferdinand, 29th of the season. And the Colombian, whose initial run. And then final cross as they lost Ferdinand. To set it up. And then for the happenings at the Riverside Stadium. Crowd desperate for this to end in a home victory. And here's Glee Clark! Off the crossbar for the second time in the match. Ferdinand. A change in the Newcastle stride, oh dear. <laughs> Clark. Unlucky. Watson. Too much for Clark, or is it? It did well, Ferdinand! Good block by Walker coming across his goal. He's 
spirit, the Verve has returned to Newcastle in the closing stages of their last match. And the final score is a draw, a result not good enough. Whether it's good enough for Spurs remains to be seen, but Kevin Keegan's team went in for the match knowing that a victory they had to find. There's Ferdinand getting the equaliser after Jason Dazelle had put Spurs ahead. But the comment in the programme of Kevin Keegan is particularly apposite. Our players have given us their best shot, and if in the final analysis it's not been quite good enough, then you have to pay tribute to the team that has been better. Kevin, first things first. Mm -hmm. It's nonsense to talk about you leaving here, isn't it? It certainly is. Rumours of my death, as they say, have been grossly exaggerated. I'll be here next year. I mean, I think you saw today, whatever happens at Manchester when they go back with a, with a trophy, um, I mean, congratulations to them. I mean, they've, they've had a terrific season to pull back the lead we had. And uh, with those young players and the experienced players helping them, uh, they're going to be a major threat next year. But whatever happens in Manchester can't be any more passionate and enjoyable as what, what was happening here today. I mean, it'd be frightening if we could bring back a trophy. It's eluding us at the moment, but uh, we live to fight another day and we'll have another crack next year. And uh, we're in Europe, so we've got four to go for. Oh, got a 